What is going on guys? This is Ben here. In today's video, really, really excited because uh, it's been a long time coming since uh, this is going to be going down. We are going to be maxing out some legendaries. Uh, also, we have this really awesome challenge going on, the double elixir draft challenge. You're getting some gold there. So I'm going to be playing some matches on this. I got a nice package straight from Supercell. Going to be opening that up. Uh, a lot of you probably already know what it is, but... Gonna open that up, and we have some gems. Maybe it opens up some super magical. So this video gonna be a little bit, a little bit hectic, a little bit crazy. But right off the bat, we are going to be opening, or not opening, going to be maxing out this Sparky. I don't really use Sparky a whole lot right now. Uh, I don't. I might maybe try and get like a a battle deck with him for you guys. Cause I, hey, I'm gonna be maxing out right now. So that's one max out legendary in this video. Uh, you guys can take your guesses which one you think it's gonna be. Do you think it's gonna be this bandit? <laughs> or it's gonna be the night witch. It's gonna be the night witch. Or the, it could be the lumberjack. It could be the lava hound. Uh, it could be the graveyard as well. Um, it could also be the night witch again. Uh, it's between those three. The graveyard, lumberjack, and the lava hound. Which one do you think? Leave your guesses right now in the comments. <laughs> and don't cheat, all right? But before we get into the rest of the video, definitely leave a like if you guys are excited. Uh, and also subscribe if you guys are new to the channel and hit the bell to get notified for when the video goes live. So without further ado, let's open up these free chests. And then also I'm probably gonna get into a match. And then after I get into my first match, hey, we'll take, we got the Dark Prince, we'll take it. After we get into that first match, gonna open up the package from Supercell. Uh, and I'm just gonna spoil it right now what other the max legendary will be. It's going to be the Lava Hound! Right in the shop there. I don't have enough gold, do I? I'm gonna have to get, purchase some gold here. How much am I gonna need? So it's gonna cost me 120 to buy another one, and so I'm gonna need 200k. So, boom. So now we'll just buy the card. So now we still need 30k to max it out. <clears throat> do I have enough? I do have enough gems. What am I talking about? So we just need to buy 30k. We'll just do a couple buckets. Boom. And then one more. And that'll get us over that 100k mark. So I actually I have no gold left now. Completely depleted. And then where is that Lava Hound? The Lava Hound I use... The Lava Loon I use quite a bit. So that's pretty awesome that I have that Lava Hound maxed out now. For those of you that want to see the stats compared to tournament levels. There you go. Uh, and sorry for you OCD people that it only it says zero out of one for when it's maxed out I need to get more same with the sparky and the, the inferno dragon So we're maxing out legendaries on a, a very rapid rate on this account right now. So Other than that though the double elixir draft challenge. I'm actually gonna throw on the game stone. How have you guys done? Did you guys get your your nine wins and get the full? Uh, what is it? 24k gold and then if you get uh, oh Already gone to a match. I wasn't able to see it. We'll take the fireball. But yeah, guys, double elixir draft means you can be pretty aggressive and take really, really high level or high expensive cards, I should say. Oh, this one's a tough choice. Ah, dude. They're both really, really good. I'll take the musketeer. Hopefully that doesn't come to bite me in the butt. And two spells. I'm going with the lightning just because this might come down to... Busting towers with spells. I don't know. Uh, it looks like I don't really I made a wrong choice. I should have probably took the Dark Prince That kind of sucks, so I have arrows along in here as well. Oh my god. I have so many spells Where is I'm just a goblin gang down here. Okay, we're gonna use the lightning lightning in that night witch or not night witch the regular witch uh, Dark Prince will distract with spear goblins but on skeleton army Boom nice He's got the zap. Okay, well, we're gonna have double musketeers going. We don't really have a tank. That's gonna be our issue. But I don't think he really has any good damage spells to be complete. He has a log. Yeah, he doesn't really seem as though he has that much really good damage spells. So, we'll arrow. We're basically just launching our spells at that one tower. And uh, we'll see if that comes to bite us in the butt or not. We'll throw it on our ice spirit. I think we'll. I think we're okay on this one. We, nice, he actually preempted his log and completely missed it. So, ooh, he's trying to like be super aggressive up front on the tower. Almost arrow it away. Eventually this is gonna come to bite him in the butt where he's gonna have like no elixir and I'll just have a big push with my musketeers hopefully. Boom. So he's trying to cycle fast. You can definitely tell that. Hopefully that fireball will take care of the shield, which it did. This is super fast cycle right now. Oh my god. Let's see if the log comes out. I'm actually gonna have to lightning spell here. 
There we go. So I think we got this one pretty much in the bag. Unless I make like a utter misplay. But this guy does not have anything like that I'm really, really scared of, to be completely honest. Spree Goblins defer deflect. It did not happen. See if the log comes out? The log did not come out. Okay, the ice spirit, dude. So we're gonna get a nice little fireball here. Boom. Yeah, dude, we just have too much control with our spells. Kind of unfortunate for him, but hey. At least taking the, the, the it didn't really affect us a whole lot. I think at this point he knows it's gonna be kind of over here. All right, that actually might come back to haunt me. Come on! No! 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 Did I just mess this one up, guys? I think so. This is probably GG. I was talking so much smack in the beginning. All I just need to do is cycle that log twice. And he's got the victory. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Where's that log coming? Dude, I was, I was like, oh, we got this. No big deal. And then he just he completely obliterated us on that push. I think what, what, I, what I shouldn't have done is lightning spell the shield off of his Dark Prince. Ah, oh, man. Well, that kind of sucks. Talking all high and mighty, and then you, <laughs> then you freaking lose. Well, we're going to go on a different note here. We're going to open up a Super Magical. I'm actually really kind of bummed that I, that I messed that one up. It was looking so good. And then it just fell apart. All right, we got the lightning. So we are going to get Legendary here. We're so close to the Lumberjack. We need one more. Well, we're now going to open up the real life package from Supercell. I'm going to move my stuff out of the way here. All right. So we have this very generic box here. You can see I cut it open already. And uh, I was really excited for this because a lot of the stuff I ordered a very long time ago, back when I got these P.E.K.K.A.s here and they weren't going to be releasing until now and you can see some of this stuff is clash of clans stuff but they're very very awesome basically figures so, so you can see the wizard this is the first one out of the box not super big if we put them up in comparison to the pekkas not very big at all but these are like little action figures and uh it's gonna look really cool on my backdrop there and especially when i move into my new house like, I'll have a way better setup, as uh, those of you that do not know, building. And then next up, we got a Clash Royale related one. We got that Prince. Look at that face. Look at that beard, man. Oh my god. So I'm really excited to see how this guy looks. These are going to be a pain in the butt to open, though, for sure. This is probably my favorite one, for sure. I don't know why it's not fully focusing. Maybe because my face is, like, in range. But, dude, the Prince looks awesome. He's definitely a lot taller than the wizard, but we got we got a few more here. I'll show you guys. I'm just gonna show you guys the packaging, and then I'll open them all. Archer, another Pekka, another regular wizard, and then a barbarian. So these kind of all came as like a package deal. So you get all of them if you. And there was like a really good deal. Then another Clash Royale pin. So we'll get these open. And you can see the see how they look. So here we have the P.E.K.K.A. Honestly, this is probably my favorite one besides the Prince. Like, definitely a little, obviously smaller, but so, so cool. The detail with the horns and the paint and everything. I just think this one looks amazing. And then the sword is actually kind of sharp, so <laughs> be careful if you get this one. Uh, and then we have the, obviously, the regular wizard, which is this bad boy right here. I think he actually looks better than the, the one with the red one. I personally like the regular wizard better. Um, you can see the difference. Um, it's not really focusing, I'm sorry. And then the last two that we have, we have the Barbarian and the Archer right here. So Barbarian obviously looks a little cool, a little interesting, got a nice little mustache there. So. So we actually have all of the figurines now up there in place of the the Pekkas, but the Pekkas are definitely a lot bigger, a lot more solid. 
uh, but they're still cool. They're really, really awesome. So uh, yeah, that's what they are. And if you guys want to buy some for yourself, they are on the Supercell shop. Keep in mind, Supercell is not paying me to make this video at all. Uh, I actually bought those with my own money and everything. So they're just cool. And they're cool little mementos for a game that I play every day, as you guys know. So other than that though, let's try and get another match. Double Elixir Draft Challenge. This one's a tough choice. I gotta go with the Prince it's in, since we just opened them. Hopefully I get something to counter the air. We'll actually take the Executioner. Now the Executioner will be a goofy one to buy. <laughs> like, just can you imagine just having him, dude? He'd be kind of a little scary, but... I don't know, you can't even really see him up there. I'm looking at him right now on my webcam. See the wizard the most? The P.E.K.K.A. you can kind of see behind the Prince, but... Hey, let me know what you guys' thoughts on those uh, little action figures. I don't even I don't even know the best way to say them. Little figurines, I guess. But other than that, man, I, I do not want to blow this match. I pew pew. Okay. Go for this one. Like last match, dude, we blew so hard. Fireball, okay. Oh, he's got skeletons. I was gonna say, is my prince actually gonna get there? And see how when the balance changes do come out, it'll be really, really, really nice when that, uh... okay, well, we're gonna have to lightning spell this balloon, otherwise we will lose our tower. Um, it's gonna be really, really nice when the skeletons are only, like, there's only three of them for the singular one elixir skeletons, because then my prince would have actually got a hit onto the tower there. I will opt to pump up. He probably has a rocket. I mean, he took the, he gave me the lightning. Or not. I guess, I guess we can throw on another bomb tower, why not? Maybe he'll drop that balloon, we'll see. Guess we'll throw it on the prince. Oh, he's starting the cycle on the towers, okay. Throw it on some goblins. Bam. Oh, there's another balloon. This time we are gonna lightning for that. I need to go for some tower damage, but I'm, I can't really do a whole lot right now. So we're just off to pump up again. Once we get our elixir collectors going, there's no way this guy's gonna be able to slow us down, man. I guess I'll just throw on a random prince. See what he does with that, and some goblins. The prince should go for the tower. Alright, nice. We'll at least get some prince tower damage in there. For once. Another fireball. Throw on some goblins. Throw down this. Uh, we are going to need the lightning spell. Actually, no. We'll see. We'll see if we can guard this here. Balloon's gonna get some damage. Inferno tower right off the start. We'll throw down some spear goblins. Get some damage in there. I don't know, guys. This isn't looking too good for us. No, I was not picking my nose there. I was scratching my beard. <laughs> Zap that Inferno Tower. Even though I have four Elixir Collectors. I don't know, guys, if I'm going to be able to win this. Go for it. Lightning that. Did we get this match, dude? Let's go. Well, the Elixir Collectors, I think, are what saved us there. We could go for a big push right at the end there. Man, that was really close, though. So, hey, we're 2-0. Uh, we need to get, what, one more win to get some more gold? I mean, we'll see if we can make it happen. Uh, <laughs> we'll, we'll put up a magical chest for you guys. Can I break the streak? No, I cannot. That match was in testimony. This was the MVP right here. Actually, I'd say the lightning spell was, but you can't. No one's gonna. If you. <laughs> okay, there probably would be some people, but you know how, like, they have figurines for iconic characters, like, up here? Would. <laughs> I don't think anyone would buy a lightning spell, like, thing. Uh, figurine. Like, it would just be, like, a little bottle. It would be, like, kind of like this. Just, like, blue. 
maybe kind of rectangular <laughs> i don't even know never mind well you guys get what i'm saying would you buy a spell version of a figurine i don't know if i would probably i probably would let's be real here but get back to the draft man oh oh i gave him the counters to my to my to my dark off and this is uh Wait, we got everyone's giving me the lightning spell. Why? What is this? Lightning spell is one of the best spells for draft. Unless it's the rocket. Oh. 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 Well, at least our dark album's gonna be out of that poison for a while, so. Pretty much countered that nicely. Alright. Well, maybe it was graveyard. Hey, even more value. He thought that dark goblin was not gonna die. So I'm not really scared of the. Oh no, I can't get that witch inside of that range he placed that pretty well there we'll give it to we'll give him the we'll give him the, the applaud there well played bro put on some tombstone as well get that action going another graveyard so put the dark goblin up front here might get long or might get logged that's cool fine with that might as well start another lava hound push Oh man. Oh, uh, I can't say once we hit double elixir, this is gonna get any easier for us because we are in double elixir. <laughs> oh my gosh. I guess I'll throw it on this. The Inferno Tower is gonna be late for targeting. At least the Lumberjack got there, man. Just enrage it. Just add insult to injury there. So we did get the tower. Nice. Uh, I guess we'll throw a tombstone back here. He's probably gonna try and graveyard again soon. The other side. All right. You don't care, man. You just activated my king tower. Nice. So that's actually gonna help. Oh, he's got elite barbarians. I was not expecting that. I don't have anything to stop the elite barbarians except for this bad boy right here, the lumberjack, and then throw on maybe a tombstone. <laughs> Ice Wizards are probably going to take my tower, though. Okay. Is that witch going to be in range of it? Oh my gosh, it moved at the last second. So I cannot get that witch in range of my lightning spell, dude. It's in range, everybody. I don't have any use for that rage spell, dude. Except for right then. Throw on the bomb tower. Uh, we'll throw on the lumberjack as defense. Tombstone. Distract those elite barbarians. Mega Minion needs to take out this witch. There we go. So I think we got this one, guys. I mean, I said that last, uh, not last game, but the game where I completely messed it up. Uh, Ice Wizard there. Okay, we're gonna see Inferno Tower. We're going to see this weird little bomb tower. Um, okay. We're gonna need the lightning. Will this rage you guys up to the tower? Go, 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 go. Lumberjack. Go, 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 go. It's kind of redundant to throw on the lumberjack because he's gonna die and get his rage as well, but it was helpful. He doesn't have his log. I think we got this one. There we go. GG. Good game, bro. Rough start there. It is what it is. So we'll do one more and then we'll wrap up the video here. Should we, dude, like, it, I gotta, I have to get, I have to get a Magical Chest Legendary soon here. It's been so long. It's continuation of the last video. I probably opened up like 10 of those now in a row and no, no Legendary whatsoever. So why can't I battle? There we go. Waiting for a while. I was like just clicking it, clicking it, clicking it. Well, let me, ooh, this is a tough choice. Never mind, it really wasn't that tough. Ah, uh, uh, if I take the arrows, I mean, if I take the princess, he has the arrows. Uh, if I take the witch, the princess is gonna be nasty. I guess we'll take the witch. I don't really have a great counter to the, the princess now though. We'll go with Valkyrie. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. I don't really like it depends on what he drafted. I do not like my draft here 
So we got, at least we have the poison and the goblin. Well, he's, he's got arrows for the goblin barrel. If I would have had the princess, it would have been like he had to choose. I guess we'll still have Valkyrie for to, to counter that. Boom. Nice. He did get a little bit of chip damage done in there. Hopefully he doesn't have the lightning. Because that would suck. He's got a wizard. Alright. We'll do wizard. Gob or lecture wizard. I'm getting so messed up here. Elite Barbarian's Goblin Barrel. Oh, he's got a rocket. He's This boy's got a rocket? At least our Goblin Barrel did a lot of work there. He went for a rocket instead of a arrow on the Goblin Barrel. So, yeah, that's pretty good for us. I'll throw it on the Mega Minion just to take care of that little bomber there. And nice. Didn't He did not get a whole lot of tower damage there, but... That rocket, we are definitely going to be scared of. And we'll throw the Trick Goblin Barrel in case it decides to arrow it. Yes, it worked! Let's go! <laughs> That's how we do, man. And then we'll poison this princess. Alright. So is the Pekka going to get there? Mini Pekka got a hit. Alright. This is looking pretty good for us right now. This cannot make any fatal mistakes. All that stuff's gonna be enraged. I guess we'll throw on the Mega Minion. See, like, the princess is so annoying to deal with. Throw on the P.E.K.K.A. Save that tower damage from the wizard. First time, no, second time throwing on the witch. He knows I has this card, I think, right? He played defense with the bomber there. I think he would've been better off if he would've threw that behind his tower. Throw on the Goblin Barrel, see if he arrows uh, and poison just because. Get some more damage done. I think we got the tower now. We did. All right. Uh, Lumberjack coming out. I don't know. Like, dude, the Goblin Barrel is so annoying. Unless you guys get a, a draft counter with the Goblin Barrel, I would say take it. Because there's so many times where I opt to, like, give it to the other person, and it just comes back to bite me in the butt so hard. Uh, we'll throw the Night Witch up front. See if he wants to rocket it. I don't know if he will. Yeah. He, uh, uh, is he going to get it? Very close. Very, very close there. That was, uh, we almost got away with that one. The Night Witch. Why did I say Night Witch? The, the Witch getting out. Dude, like, my card name pronunciation in this game is trash. I'm getting literally every card wrong or mixed up with something else. I don't know why. Maybe it's because all of these, these guys chilling right here messing me up. Uh, I could just cycle my poison, but he's not even, I doubt he's even going to get a tower. There's no way. Yeah, I'll do this then. Whoop. See if we get the arrows. What you did. So, good game, bro. Guys, I'll try and get this uh, double elixir draft challenge all the way up. We There's two days left on this challenge, so I'm pretty sure I'll be able to get that nine wins fairly easily. Maybe even on this run. Um, but other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you like it, and don't forget to subscribe for more Clash Royale videos. And I'll see you guys later.